We first shared this surveillance video last night. A man there on a scooter. He was hit by a truck as that truck was pulling out of a garage that was a parking garage in downtown Indianapolis. This incident happened earlier this month, but now Mac Brown is suing the garage, the driver, and traffic officer. And Mary Mills tells us Brown, like many other riders, weren't following the rules. Mary says those rules haven't really been enforced yet. Mary? Yeah, Brown was on the sidewalk, and city rules say you can only ride scooters in the street or in bike lanes. Uh, so far, those rules, though, haven't been enforced, drawing a lot of complaints, but that's about to change. We stood along East Washington near Delaware for half an hour and saw dozens of scooters go by and all but one buzz by where they're not allowed on the sidewalk and cultural trail. Yes, he's not supposed to be on the sidewalk. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not sure that everyone is aware of that. But Lieutenant Woolley says they likely will be as police start enforcing the rules. He says an internal bulletin sent to officers last week gives them the go-ahead to start issuing citations. I don't know that there will be a massive crackdown, but uh, it's definitely something the officers are going to be aware of and they'll be looking for. And He says initially they could face some challenges. I would imagine that it would be a little bit more difficult to pull over a scooter. Do you do it on foot or car? I don't know yet. I guess we've got to work through that. And the fines for riding on sidewalks and trails is 20 bucks the first time, $40 the second time. Uh, scooter companies could also face fines for parking the scooters illegally, be it driveways, right away, things like that. Certainly based on what we've seen today, the city could be taking in some decent money. Live downtown, Mary Mills, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.